Before starting the application, make sure you have all the tools for the task. For this particular application, you will also need 3M finish line knifeless tape. For cleaning, pour a small amount of 3M surface preparation system onto a lint-free cloth and wipe smoothly inside the recess. Once cleaned, use a dry lint-free cloth to thoroughly dry the surface, making sure all solvents are removed. You can also use a professional heat gun to remove any final traces of solvent. Remove the finish line knifeless tape from its resealable pouch. Carefully attach the finish line knifeless tape to the inside edges of the recess. This will allow you to cut the wrap film later on without damaging the paintwork. Once completed, repeat the process to the outside edge of the recess. It's important that the two lines overlap at the end of the inlay to build a corner. Attach appropriately sized wrap film pieces to the recess in order to form the stencil. Make cuts in the film to remove the tension from the corner. Start cutting first with the knifeless tape that was applied last. Grip the end of the knifeless tape, fold it back, and with both thumbs touching, tug and release the filament for cutting. Pull the line back and stop before the edge of the film. Press the finger over the filament and film edge. Gently tug to start cutting. Continue to pull the filament forwards and not upwards. Repeat with each film overlap. Once completed, remove the excess film, including the remaining two strips of the cut knifeless tape. Now use the first applied knifeless tape for cutting. Even if there is a small wrinkle in the film, finish line knifeless tape will not tear. Remove the excess film and the two strips of knifeless tape. Remove the stencil in one piece, taking particular care with the film overlaps. Try not to overstretch the material. You now have your stencil. Place the stencil on top of your chosen wrap film and cut to size. You can create the mirror image of the shape for the other side of the recess by flipping over the stencil and cutting to shape. Place the cut film inside the recess ensuring it fits correctly. Using your gloved finger, you can now apply the film without stress or tension. There is no need for the heat gun. After installation of the wrap film to the whole bumper, film needs to be applied to the flat inside area of the recess. Attach scotch masking tape to the top edge of the film and to the non-recess area of the bumper. Using a knife, carefully cut the film to the shape of the recess top and sides only, making sure not to damage the paintwork. With the masking tape, the film edge is stiff enough to allow you to place the film inside the recess. Use a squeegee to finish the application. Remove the masking tape from the film edge. And remove the remaining masking tape from the top edge of the film. With this method, the wrap film can be applied without tension to the recess of the license plate. <laughs>